Hey guys, welcome to Life Elite Fitness, and today we are doing an ab workout. So we are gonna be down on the mat, we're doing this entire workout with you, it's gonna be great. All right guys, so we're gonna go ahead and start with active stretching first. This is really important to go ahead and wake up those muscles, get them ready to move. Ready? All right, head going down, and just moving through. Again, we're keeping this active, you're always moving. That way we're not actually loosening up any joints. We're just letting the muscles loosen up. We're gonna go ahead and side to side. Here we go. And I usually do anywhere between five to 10 is good, just depending on how stiff you are. And we're gonna do half circles. Rolling. I always go the wrong way. We're so excited to do this workout with you guys today. We love working abs. This is a great workout to just add into your daily routine or if you don't have very much time, this is a perfect workout to do. You can do it anywhere. Come into shoulders. It's gonna be great. Roll the shoulders, stretch out your chest. Keep your core engaged while we're doing this. And forward. And elbows going back. All right, and forward. All right, and twist it. Getting that spine warm. Warming up that core a little bit too. Okay, and we're gonna go ahead, you're gonna stand wide, crossing over, getting those legs involved, opening up those hamstrings. And coming straight down to center, rolling up. Go ahead and do five of those. Two more. And there we go. Great job, guys. All right, so we got those muscles warm. Now we're going to go ahead and move into a warm up where we're getting your heart and your lungs ready to actually start working out. So, I like to have a little fun with the warm up, so it's not too dancey, but it's a little dancey. Gotta get a little dancey. Here we go, and beginning, 30 seconds each one. Just shuffling, back and forth. Boom. We've got this. Button that heart rate, get up. 15 seconds. And you have five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna go ahead and place that foot, move inside to side, replace. There you go, move it, boom. Just now like I have it. <laughs> that. There we go. Moving through. Getting those legs working, getting that heart working. Getting those lungs working. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Cross stepping. So doing a little bit of b-boy. Here we go. Oh man. Boom. Boom. Nice cool as you. I'm not yet cool. Like... I'm pretty silly. <laughs> Step. Mm. 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 Yeah. Here we go. Keeping that heart rate going. Nice. Moving through. You can let this workout keep your core tight. All right, now this. we're going back. So all you do is same move, just behind you. There we go. Pulling through. Boom. Boom. Three 
to go. Rocking out. You have ten. Three, two, two one. one. Nice. Life saving the hardest for last. We're gonna go ahead. Boom, high knees. There it is. Prancing. Keep those knees tight, guys. Keep your core tight. Just breathing through. Here we go. You have 10. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Good job, nice. guys. You warm? Now your body's ready to work. Okay, guys, so we are starting down on the mat and we're gonna begin with cat cow. So we are gonna start in a tabletop position and we're gonna arch that back, stretching out our back muscles and then flex into cat. We do that 10 times, here we go. Really suck that tummy in when you're doing this. Belly button to spine on cow and really flex all the way through on cat. Three more. Give one more. Perfect, good job guys. Next thing we're going to is bird dog. So we're gonna stay in this tabletop position and we are going to reach our left leg and right arm out and back and then switch. Remember to keep your core really tight when you're doing this. Keep those abs engaged. You got this. This is a good introduction to getting those abs ready to work. Halfway there, doing good. You also feel a little bit of that back and that glute. All around core right here. Three more. Perfect. All right, and we are gonna go flat on our bellies now to do Superman. So we're gonna work our back. It's gonna be a great workout. We're gonna do 10 Supermans, you ready? Yep. Here we go. And lift, really squeeze your glutes. You'll feel this in your lower back. Get as high as you can. Halfway there, here we go. Now we're resting, keeping those feet, those hands up. Really just hitting that contraction and release. One more. Good job, guys. All right, we're going to roll over onto our side for side planks. So we will have our feet together, or you can stagger them, whatever works best for you. And we're going to lift that hip off the ground, just like this, and down. Here we go. It's gonna work the obliques. Give you that V cut. Got this. Again, we're gradually stepping up, getting that core warm. Now we're working. Three more. And one. Good job, guys. Flipping over. Okay. So. <laughs> Here we go. Ow. There's five. Here we go, guys. Doing great. You might notice one side is stronger than the other. That's totally normal. Do the best you can. Two more. 
great job. So the next thing we're gonna do is sit up. So if you wanna do this with a partner, you can. We're gonna show you real quick what that looks like. So you can link feet and lean back and sit up, just like that. Keep it up. Let's got this. Now we're working. This is good stuff here. Give me one more. Ten. <laughs> good job. There we go. And if you're really talented, you can do this. But I can't leech. Mm. Hamstrings aren't flexible. <laughs> Okay guys, so now we are going on to candlesticks. So on candlesticks, we're gonna lean flat on our back and we're going to lift our feet up and kind of do a little pulse, get your hips off the ground. Here we go. If you wanna make this easier, you can bend your feet, bend your legs, or you can keep your feet straight the whole time. There's five. Keep it up. These are those lower abs working right now. You've got this. And there's 10. Nice. Whew. Okay guys, so we're gonna be back in this position for heel grabs and we're going to have our knees bent. We're gonna reach for our ankles with each side. We're gonna be on the same side, reaching each hand for that angle. All right, here we go. One, two, three. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice. Great job, guys. Those are harder than they look. Okay, guys, so again, we're hitting those lower abs just like we did with the candlesticks. So we're gonna go flat on our back and we're gonna do jackknife. So a jackknife is similar to a candlestick, except we're going to lift our upper body with our lower body. So we're gonna come up and down. There's a couple ways to do this. You can do it with bent knees if you need to to make it a little easier, or straight legs. There's five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Whew. Yeah, so that's probably one of my favorite exercises. We're getting upper, lower abs, all of it's just having to work together. And uh, it doesn't get much better than teamwork. <laughs> So now we're going back into that V position and we're gonna do pulses. So you can do this a couple of ways. You're gonna go into a V position. If you need to keep your feet on the ground the first time, that's okay. But if you can lift them off the ground, we're going to lean back in that V position and pulse our hands. Here we go. If you wanna make it harder, you can straighten your legs. There you go. Get some, get some. You've got this, knocking out abs. Six. Here we are. Seven. If you're not filling them by now, you're eight. a beast. <laughs> Nine and ten. There we go. Great job. All right, guys, and for our last workout, we're gonna flip over into plank. And we're just gonna burn it out. So we're gonna hold our plank for 30 seconds. If you can go longer, that's great. Here we go. You guys have done awesome. Keep your core tight, keep your glutes engaged. That's a big mistake people make because they forget to engage their glutes. That can be really hard on your lower back, so keep your abs and your glutes tight. Halfway there, here we go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job, you guys. All right, guys, way to go. Cranked out that workout. Got those abs shredded. Now we're gonna go uh, eat some nutritious food so those abs show. Or Ben and Jerry's. <laughs> Let's call it how it is. <laughs> <laughs>